Hey everyone, Michael O'Brien here, and today I just wanted to talk about In and of Itself by Derek Delgadio. Hey guys, uh, thank you so much for uh, checking out this video. This is going to be sort of a review. I will not be doing any spoilers in this video, so if you guys haven't seen Derek's show yet and you want to do so, you're welcome to watch this video. I'm not going to spoil anything for you. We're going to talk just about uh, the show in general and why it is such a good show. Uh, I was not able to see the show live in New York, but I did get uh, an advanced copy of the Hulu special. The actual Hulu special should be uh, debuting, I believe, the end of January, January 22nd, 23rd, something like that. Um, but I did get an advanced copy of it. A good friend sent me... Uh, he said it was a copy that he was able to get a hold of. Take what you want from that. Um, but I was able to watch it, and let me tell you, it is incredible. It is probably, in my opinion, the best magic show that you'll ever see. And actually calling it a magic show kind of does it a disservice a little bit, because it's more than a magic show. It really is a glimpse into Derek's mind the storytelling is incredible, the staging, the lighting, the special effects, everything that happens in this show is just phenomenal. And the acting, you know, it's, when you think of a magic show, you know, you think of some cheesy, like, you know, magician coming on stage, maybe doing a card manipulation routine. And then, um, you know, if he is acting, usually it's like kind of goofy and stuff like that. Um, or if it's like a Max Maven, he's trying to be serious, but he isn't being serious. And so, you know, you know that something's going on or whatever. Derek Delgadio does a good job of really making you believe the things that he's talking about are real. And he does a good job of mixing in real things that have happened to him in his life and kind of weaving everything together where you don't know what is true and what isn't. Um, and on top of that, of course, the magic, the sleight of hand is, it's phenomenal. He does six effects, I believe. I'd have to go back and watch again. Six effects over an hour and a half. So over the span of an hour and a half, he does six pieces of magic. Now you're probably thinking like, how does he do six pieces of magic in over an hour and a half? Like, how is that even possible? Well, watch it and you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. One of my favorite effects that he does literally he just makes an object vanish like that's that's all the effect is he places an object down and makes it vanish it's like three second long effect but the story that he tells and everything that goes into it like by the end of it you're you're like in tears like you're starting to well up like it's it's pretty crazy you know how emotional it gets and there's a couple times, you'll notice this, this stuck out to me right away. During the show, he'll be talking to the audience and he'll kind of turn around and he'll look at a prop that's on stage. And he'll he'll kind of look at that prop and he'll just have like that look on his face like he's thinking and then kind of snaps out of it and just like realizes like, oh yeah, that's right, like I'm here on stage in front of people. Like, have you ever done that? Like where you're looking at someone but you're thinking about something else and then you realize like, oh shit, I'm thinking about that. And then you kind of come back into reality real quick. So it's almost like, you know what I mean? Like he, he does that a few times and it's, it's crazy because the acting is just like really good. Like I, I don't know how to explain. I don't want to go into too much detail because again, I don't want to give anything away. I want you guys to really, um, take all of this in because it's a really good show and um, the stories that he tells are incredible like I said the magic is phenomenal I think he does like one maybe two card tricks and when I say tricks I mean like you know gambling demonstration kind of stuff like the typical Delgadio like you know expert at the card table stuff that he does um, but most of it is is very good theater interact the way he interacts with the props and everything so um i highly recommend you watch in and of itself on hulu 
once it comes out, I'm definitely going to watch it again. I'm going to sit down, um, you know, with my family and we're going to put it on and we're going to make like a movie night out of it. Because I really do think that it is, it is definitely worth watching. Um, I was fortunate enough to be able to catch Derek and Helder doing their show Nothing to Hide here in Los Angeles a few years ago when they were doing that show. And that show is amazing. I think this one is better. So if you saw Nothing to Hide and you liked that, I definitely think that you'll like uh, In and of Itself. It's it's just a great show. And um, if you guys have seen it, if you are one of the people fortunate enough to actually go and see it live, leave a comment below and describe the feeling that you got watching it. Don't post spoilers, but I really want people to understand, like, like I said, I wasn't there live, but watching it through the TV, by the end of it, like, I was an emotional mess. Like, I'm all welling up and, like, tears and, like, you get chills down your back. And it's, it's just, it's a great show. So, In and of Itself by Derek Delgadio. You can watch it on Hulu. When? I'm not 100% sure exactly the date that it releases. It will be out by the end of January. I believe the 22nd is the release date. But again, don't quote me on that. Um, I'll try to leave a link in the description below for you guys so that you can go try to find out for yourself. Otherwise, just Google it. You guys know how to do that, right? Um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. It's kind of a mini review, more of a reaction video than anything. Um, more of a go watch this because you really should because it's like the best thing you've ever seen in your life kind of video um so yeah that's it my name is michael o'brien thank you so much for taking the time to watch this when you go to watch in and of itself try your best to watch it uninterrupted from start to finish go in your room put on your headphones watch it on your tablet watch it on if you can watch it on a big screen even better um just try to watch it uninterrupted from start to finish all the way through because again it is amazing and all I can say is that I wish that I was able to see this show live.